Hey guys, Stu here. Uh, just doing a follow up from uh, when I originally did this uh, with the HP MV17. Uh, I have put an SSD in there, the SanDisk um, Extreme. Uh, it's pretty good, it's a 120 gig. Uh, it's an alright SSD. I've also upgraded my memory to 8 gigs of Corsair Vengeance. These are 1600 MHz, but Obviously, if you're watching this for this, it only really um, uses the speed of uh, 1333. I mean, it was only an extra uh, five pounds for like these ones. So I thought if I ever did get another laptop, I can always just upgrade my RAM into that. So it's pretty cool. Two times four gigs, 1600. Um, there's my old 500 gig hard drive. It was actually a Five thousand uh, two hundred spin, wasn't a seven uh, seven thousand two hundred. But yeah, um, I timed the last um, from from the um, video. I actually timed um, how long it took for the computers to boot up and stuff. And just bear with me. It was one minute twenty. Uh, no, sorry, one minute twelve. And yeah, I mean that that was pretty quick. But obviously this is just gonna be better, hopefully. I have already been on here and installed everything as it should be. I will just get the um, power leads and then there's no uh, difference in like the speeds of like being on the battery and whatever else. Bear with me. Right. There we have it. Right. I will open it up. I will press go, and then I'll record and I'll mention in the um, in the uh, description of how long it um, took to boot up. Or you can just probably see from when you look on there anyway. I mean, I've literally pressed on, it's booting into Windows. As you can see, Windows is starting. Real good picture of me. <laughs> and we're in there straight away. Everything's loaded within seconds. So, I mean, that must have only been about 30 seconds, but everything's now on oh I also because uh, obviously because of the heat issue and stuff I did um, look into all that and uh, people were saying about uh, taking it all to pieces and um, you know just uh, reapplying thermal compound and I went ahead and done all that anyway and I don't know if you can really see there might be able to just make it out but that does say 45 degrees now 46 45 um, yeah to do that obviously you do have to take everything off obviously the tops uh, unscrew all the bottom um, then you have to remove your um, keyboard unscrew all the bits in there then you have to prise out all the way around the edge around here and then you have to take off your um, cooler and then obviously reapply thermal paste to the graphics card as well as the CPU but yeah obviously it worked because it dropped my temps down about what 20 30 percent so you know it's really good I mean I don't have no problems now I don't burn my legs or anything like that now so you know, it's really good but I mean the only problem that I have been having is I did want to put the 500 gig back in um, obviously where it can store two drives in here uh, one being that side one being this side I am um, I've been struggling to get a lead obviously in the UK to get the caddy kit for this it's for, uh, 40 pounds but um, I really I, I can't justify spending 40 quid on a lead and a caddy so I'd, I've just been trying to look around like trying to get leads and stuff and I've, I've, I've had a nightmare with it so far I've either got 
the right SATA, like SATA connector end or I've got the wrong one and then I've got the other um, end which is the connector end to the laptop which has been the right one and then the wrong one and yeah it's just a pain in the ass really so I mean if anybody has got any ideas of um, where to get a lead from that's like cheap then obviously I can go ahead and stick this back in but until then I've got 120 gig um, SSD which is pretty cool because all I do is play um, Battlefield 3 anyway and um, see there I've got Pro Evo probably just make it out Pro Evo 2013 demo which is pretty cool for all you Pro Evo lovers um, but yeah apart from that though that that's my um, update of this and hope you've enjoyed hope it's um, shed some light on some things if you do have any questions uh, ask me in the comments uh, if not don't um, yeah subscribe and catch you guys later peace out bye